I get asked to do a session. By a weird coincidence, the other two musicians turn out to be Sting and Stewart. Within short order, the police, as the world knows the band, is born. It seems like only five minutes ago that we were pushing a broken van back through the streets of London after a gig we played to no one. I think, f*** it, it's just not worth it. Sting, poor I, suggests that maybe we try out his new song. Rocks. You don't have to put on the red light. Those days are over. You don't have to show your body to the night. The band is getting bigger than I ever imagined it could be. We have had the number one single in the United States for eight weeks. We are a phenomenon. I want my MTV! The success of the band eats everything. Sting is fast becoming a media darling. The truth is that this attention to our singer does cause friction. Should we film me whooping Sting? Yes. That would be good. That would be good. I'll begin photographing everything around me. We finish up the album, Ghost in the Machine, and that's about what I feel like, a ghost. It feels like Sting has already broken away. There is the lingering shadow that maybe he will go solo. I'm quitting first. I'd like to introduce the band. Andy, this is Stuart. I remember you. We're going to go on tour. This is the biggest gig of our lives. I dreamed about the band. There was a need for closure. 